This is the first game that we're going to be covering in the Halloween Hauntathon this year, and that will be Fatal Frame 2 Crimson Butterfly. I haven't played it in quite some time, but I played it quite frequently with my very good friend um, for many years, so I do remember most about it, and um, I do find the game to be pretty scary sometimes. So the developer is Tecmo, and it was originally released in 2003 on the PlayStation 2. And it was later released on the Xbox in 2004 and was made available on the PlayStation Network on May 7th, 2013. This is a survival horror game and a single player game. The story focuses on Mio and Mayu, I think, if that's how you pronounce their name. Um, and they wander, <laughs> they wander into a village basically at night. Um, Mayu was seemingly taken over by the place, possessed by the place, so she went off wandering by herself. And then for the rest of the game, you were playing as Mio, looking for Mayu, basically. Um, because it's a creepy Japanese village, obviously it's haunted, and so what Mio does is she finds a camera obscura. So the belief in Japan basically is that you can capture souls if you take a picture of the ghost kind of thing. I don't know if that's their actual belief, but in this game that seems to be the belief. So you take pictures of the ghost, and sometimes that can be very difficult because it has to line up correctly, um, and the better it lines up, the more clear the shot that you can get of the ghost, the better your score is, and the better the damage that you will do to them as well, depending on your shot. Um, so it is a really scary game just in that all that you have to defend yourself with is a camera obscura. And most of it's kind of running away and, and trying to capture ghosts and trying to get points. And you get points to upgrade your camera so that it can do special things and um, increase attack power as well. So that's kind of the gist of it. There's a lot of ghosts. There's a lot of kind of cult activity and, and like sacrificial stuff. Um, I don't want to give anything away because that would be bad. But it's a really excellent survival horror game. I do recommend it. For anyone that hasn't played it before, it's an older game, but I do think it holds up pretty well overall. Um, so yeah, I really, really do recommend it just because you do have that feeling of like, oh crap, all I have is a camera. This is really scary. So again, please check out Fatal Frame 2 Crimson Butterfly if you haven't already. And uh, if you have, then please let me know down below your thoughts on the game. And thank you so much for watching. I'll have more coming up soon and more games as well. Okay, thank you. I hope that you're having a great October. Happy Halloween!